No, I thought it was uh, pretty pretty solid. Interesting to uh, take in some some nice uh, wholesome family fun in that. Yeah, yeah. Tiger Woods <laughs> more, like family, 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 more like making families. More like making families. Yeah. 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 No, I thought yeah. it was good. It was. No, I, I yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I said this before, but uh, yeah, I, I thought the first part is it, a two parter. Um, the first part I thought was a little bit disjointed and uh, not really focused on his life, more about his his family and his specifically his father, which is still interesting, but I, I felt that they could have only released the second part and I would have enjoyed it this, like the same amount. I would have gotten the same amount of... I think you know. the first part's necessary though, just because of how fucked up he got. Yeah, I yeah. guess. I think I think they maybe, up bringing his I think they life, maybe yeah. I think they maybe could have uh shortened the like they maybe could have cut out a lot of the stuff in the first part and like added like maybe a half hour to the second part and just made it one thing. Yeah, no, that's fair. Yeah. No, I mean that was that was good. That was that's exciting to watch. Tiger was an absolute beast. And in more ways than one. In more ways than yeah. one. He's on and off the golf course. He did dirty work. Yeah. Mr. On and off the course. Yeah. Get this guy 50 million subs. Yeah. Speaking of YouTube. Get this guy 50 million Speaking subs. Speaking of YouTube, I brought up the Tiger documentary just so I could plug my <laughs> own channel. We did it at the start. Yeah. You know that you get all. one per episode. Yeah. One per episode. Don't go any further. But no, I feel like the part about the dad is crucial because I kind of, I didn't know that. I don't think a no, lot of people. No, I don't. Nobody knew and that. I think that's important because, like, if that's known, you know, everyone yeah. knew that, then that'd be, you know, important. But I, then we also talked about the, you know, you can go on about how it was staged a bit with the. Yeah, side yeah. Game. I mean, you, you kind of have to watch it to formulate your opinion, but yeah, um, yeah. I was just gonna say I haven't like heard anything about Tiger's like reaction to it or anything. Like, I don't know if he. Yeah. Has seen it. Like he probably he, doesn't want to watch it. He, I, I wouldn't really expect him to say anything about it because he's he's never really been one to engage on social media himself. But does he have social media? He technically does, but like it's run by his like PR, so not really. No, a lot of it was taken. A lot of people were like, "Oh, this puts." It got it got a ton and... of heat, like on on Twitter and stuff. Like uh, before the first episode came out. Uh, I think maybe a week or two before it actually released to the public, there was like uh, some people that got early access to, to see it and stuff like that, and then like all this shit started coming up on Twitter, like all oh, the Tiger documentary sucks, like well, it's just it's just a hit piece on them, and it's just all these like What's, it's I'm, all I'm, true a, stuff. I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm definitely it is a tr it is true stuff, but like I'm a I'm a Tiger fan, I always have been, but like. It's just Tiger, like diehard Tiger fans that don't want to hear anything bad about him, and they want to kind yeah. of like gl glaze over all of the stuff that happened off the course and stuff. Which mm -hmm. is, you know, I, you get why you don't you don't want to see like your favorite golfer, your favorite athlete, somebody you look up to in a bad sort of light. But at the same time, I find it really interesting, like uh, knowing all that stuff, ha knowing about all that stuff that happened off the course and. Yeah. All the details and stuff and accounts from other people and yeah, so yeah. no, I enjoyed it. The second part especially was really good. Yeah, no, it it all happened. I think it all needs to be addressed. I think when you're a high profile athlete, especially of Tiger Woods' nature or Michael Jordan, if they step out of line, if you're such a high profile guy, yeah. any sort of indiscretion that you have is always going to be definitely under the microscope more than anybody else. If it's just your average civilian, but that's unfortunately the standard that they have to uphold like tiger was a god in in ways yeah. when, in, in the early 2000s he could do no wrong and mm -hmm. he was he was the perfect guy you know and i mean lebron james is a good example if lebron james did what tiger Le lebron james would be under unbelievable yeah well i mean it's, it's, it's literally like just so. it's it's just the jordan documentary 2.0 really yeah. i mean like it's so yeah no it's it's difficult for him but it's all necessary to put in there in my opinion, i, th I think it is necessary to put in as well so, yeah right? I, I, I think, like, well, in elementary school, because I think I started high school in 20, when did we start high school? 2012? 2011? No, no, tw 2009. Because I remember 2010 You're was... really dumb. It was not 2009. No, 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 because I remember 2010, the year, like, we were it in was grade 20, 10. It was 2011. How old are you? We started high school. How old are you? Oh, 2012. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 2011, so, 2012 yeah, was yeah. our grade nine. Okay, year. just relax. 
Like, I'm, I, I'm, I'm calm, but you're in 2009, Kobe? <laughs> okay, we, we started high school. Me and DJ, I was in grade four in 2007. No, you weren't. Yeah, because we have... We have plus four. No, you were in grade five. Well, oh we would have been gosh. in... We would have been in both grade four and grade five in 2007. Oh, well, we tell your okay, story. Okay, okay. Anyway, <laughs> he gets offended. I, I remember, like, the... <laughs> Flash, <laughs> um, shout out to our YouTube how do you take your coffee? Yeah. Um, if you want to see me flash the finger to DJ. Um, but I remember the big things from elementary school, like drama wise, because like we were a bit young. Obviously, if we're a girl, maybe we're into different things like breakups and all that stuff. But the big things were, I still remember where I was when I found out Michael Jackson died. Yeah, yeah, me too. And I remember where I was when Tiger Woods, um, I was in Shoppers Drug Mart. When I found out like the big scandal scandal yeah. thing, mm. I was at TD Bank for Michael Jackson when we found out because obviously you don't. My parents had like you know flip, not flip phones, but like you know phones without slide slide, slide phones. phones with the keyboard. With the keyboard, yeah, keyboard. Yeah. Nice. Good like phones. an old Nokia Good or phones. like Motorola. Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Phones. So no internet on them and stuff. And same thing with the Tiger. I think Tiger was close to Michael Jackson, like the big scandal. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Uh, it was a couple of years after. Yeah, but they, they like clo- more, yeah, but they were a bit behind the, the time yeah, yeah, and sure. stuff and anything, yeah. everything. But uh, no big, big things happening. And uh, I, I, yeah, I think it's all. I, I personally think it makes me feel sorry for Tiger, because of like what he went through as a child. Okay. Like, the whole thing, because I, I have a bit you, more you, sympathy you, for him. Okay. Because obviously he feels different because he's like, oh fuck, they exposed my dad. But I look at him and say, like, oh, shit, like, you went through that when you were a kid. Like, you know, you did all this. Because I kind of look past, like, his, you know, scandals and stuff. Mm-hmm. But I'm kind of like, even for the scandals, like. Yeah. No, no, I, I always felt that way, too. Like, But you didn't you know didn't... about his dad, though. No, 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 no. But um, I, I was just going to say, like, I, I think it's important to be able to kind of separate the art from the artist. In a sense, like like if you're obviously to a certain extent, like if if one of your favorite guys is you know doing some crazy shit, then like he's murdering people. <laughs> probably not great, but yeah, like Aaron still, e- even still, like it's like you're still gonna listen to their music. You're still gonna you know because you like their art, you like their, like what they do, what how, what they are, like who they are as a person doesn't really have anything to do with you know their actions on. In their like professional field, oh, they can scramble. And yeah, say they prefer. Yeah, 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 and chip in after hitting it in the water. Anyways, you got to see the documentary. A lot of this might not make sense if you haven't seen it. Yeah. But.